When I first joined HST, the Affordable Care Act had made the healthcare insurance industry a disaster. Everyone was confused. Uh, insurance companies, agents, the government, and certainly the clients and uh, insured people. No one knew really what the choices were. and The systems didn't work. It was in an interesting time to say the least. I've grown during this process to learn more about the business, myself, uh, sales, and uh, the industry, and expanded my uh, business into not only the under 65 market, but also the Medicare market. And as you can see by my gray hair, uh, that's a good market for me to be in. Along the way though, it's been a, a journey of learning, relating to customers, and enjoying the relationship I have with my clients. So, that's perhaps the most valuable outcome of this is the experience and relationship I have with my clients and prospects. On the journey to the $10 million partnership level, I would certainly be considered the tortoise, perhaps a curious tortoise, but a tortoise nonetheless, and perhaps the oldest one to achieve this level. I want to specifically thank Liz and Gerard Cubix for calling me a few years ago and sufficiently intriguing me to become involved with Healthcare Solutions Team. I've never re regretted that decision. It's been an excellent decision for me and the outcome uh, has been very enriching. Uh, this is particularly so because I heard Joe Crivello talk a few years ago or maybe just a year ago about, I'm not the type of person he'd hire. I have outside interests, outside income, a company that films internationally, uh, a lot of distractions. And I don't argue with Joe and his approach and his, his opinion, but I'm very glad that Gerard and, and uh, Liz took me on and allowed me to become part of HST. You know, the culture at HST is, is unique. It's an excellent culture, it's, but it's a very unique asset. And I want to specifically thank Joe, uh, the founders of the company who established that culture, and Joe and the management team who retained that culture through multiple acquisitions. That's not an easy task to do. There's always someone in the acquiring company that wants to tell you how to run your business and do it better. Uh, the fact that we've maintained the essence of our culture is a real achievement uh, to Joe, uh, for Joe, and uh, we should be very grateful for that. Our part is to perform and perform as well as we can. Good performance is hard to criticize in any case, so we have a role to play in maintaining that independence, and I hope we'll all join in doing that. Everyone has their only their own way to do things. I think the most important part of enjoying the journey, because there are going to be ups and downs along the way, but is to first of all understand yourself and how you relate to people and how you establish relationships, and to be yourself. Uh, it's important that the client or prospect understand that you're there to help them, and their interests come before yours. I think that's a very important part of the whole process. But the other is also to take enough time so you can be you. You know, if the kids have a soccer game, put down the phone. I've never been a 100 call a day person. I've never been a 50 call a day person, frankly. Uh, not because it's, I can't do it, but just because I don't operate that way. I want to take time with people. I want them to understand we have a relationship. Some of them become customers right away. Some do not. Some become customers later. Many of them refer business to me, even though they're not one of my customers. So I think it's just be you, understand how you relate to your clients, and run the rest of your life. Have a balance in your life. Enjoy your kids, your wife, your life. It isn't all about uh, insurance sales for sure. Well, plans for the $10,000 bonus. Uh, I hope to add another uh, glider rating to my pilot's license. Uh, but I'm a little concerned because uh, about two months ago, we bought a new home, moved into as access to brand new home. And uh, unwittingly, I may have already spent that money. I don't know for sure, but I'm <laughs> sure I'll be informed for that at some point in time. But whatever you do with it or what I do with it is enjoy it. It's a, re it's a nice reward. I appreciate it very much. And um, we'll see whether I get a new rating on my pilot's license or... New uh, lawn furniture. I have no idea. <laughs> so, goodbye. Thanks.